Hey, what's up guys? Slump here again, giving you some more Borderlands 2 content. And what's going to happen in this video is I'm going to be teaching you how to get the top of the world achievement in Opportunity. What you basically have to do is you have to do some platforming to get on roofs and stuff. It's not that hard. The first rooftop is right here on the map. It's like in the little center area where the info kiosks are. Like those four info kiosks that talk about Jack. I show it on the map and it's pretty easy to get up that building. All you need to do is walk up the side of the building. As I show you right here. Now to get to the next rooftop from this rooftop is actually pretty easy. All you need to do is follow where I go. I fast forward the clip right here just because I was still looking for the rooftop because I didn't know exactly where it was. So in order to get to on top of this rooftop, you see that metal support beam, you can walk up that just to get on top of the rooftop. So. And there's another thing I want to talk about is that the bullet loader that spawns on the rooftop, he's invincible. Well, for me, anyway. Every time I come up here, this bullet loader is invincible. Now, to actually get the next rooftop, you need to have a friend or at least a second controller. Because there's this swing stage or suspended scaffold that goes up and down alongside of the building. And you have to press a button to raise it and lower it. And you can't be two places at once, you can't be on the scaffold and you can't press the button. So you need to at least have a friend or a second controller. I use the second controller. After I show you how to get to the actual building and where the button is, I'll show you um, what you have to do with the second controller, which is not that hard. All you need to do is press a button. So here's the button that you use to lower the swing stage. Now to get on the sport beam, simple. I didn't figure it out until a couple seconds, but all you need to do is just get on top of these black boxes and run and jump towards the support beam. Once you actually get onto the swing stage, you can use your second controller or ask your friend to raise you up by pressing the button. And from here, all you need to do is some platform on the side of the wall here that I show you how to do. And as soon as you get into that little balcony area, you should be able to get the challenge top of your world for opportunity. So that's the end of the video. Thank you for watching and I'm out.